What up fam, welcome back to the channel again, welcome back to the vlog. Coming at you with some killer content. So first off, I got everything loaded in the back, I don't know if you can see, but I loaded all those heavy ass tires. Kinda, gotta catch my breath. But yeah, I got everything all packed up, ready to go. I'm gonna go to my boy's house, Reggie again. If you didn't see him on the last vlog, go check it out. I'm gonna put the link in the description. Yeah, so I'm gonna head there right now. We'll get everything unloaded. Stay tuned. Be ready. It'll be a crazy one. <laughs> Reggie going at it. Almost finished with the track bar. Just a little update for y'all. How's it going, Reg? Oh, it's like <laughs> no ways to put this thing. <laughs> We've been going at it for well, a good hour, Reg. About an hour on this damn track bar. We thought it was gonna be kind of simple, remove and replace, but oh. <laughs> but give you guys an update as soon as we get this done, and we can do the coils. I slap these damn tires on. All right, see you guys in a bit. Finally got the track bar in. All good. It was a bitch. About two hours. So we got the track bar on. Now we just gotta do coils, shocks, put everything down, torque everything down, and we should be good. Give you guys an update later. All right.
bit of rare leaves today. Um, this is the second day. So, got the tires off. We're gonna put those two dual leaf packs in here. Reggie is getting the other side done. Yeah, Reggie. Got it done. How was it last night, Reg? Pretty tiring. <laughs> yeah, we had a long night last night, about finish around 10, so we're gonna get. I'm just gonna update you guys with uh, what we finished. I don't wanna bore you guys with the boring stuff. It's pretty much your basic shit, so um, I'll just keep you guys updated on parts that we put on, problems that we come up with, so. Stay tuned. Nope. All right, we got the U-bolts off. We didn't have any C-clamps, so we just put some <laughs> straps, hold the pack together. We're gonna bolt this, uh, unbolt the centering pins and go from there. Gee! Right, so what, are we, what are we doing right now? <laughs> Trying to figure out if we should put all four of them, <laughs> get a 10 inch lift, or just put the two. I think it's supposed to be a remove and replace thing. They didn't come with instructions, so we'll see what we gotta do. You can watch YouTube. See how it's done on YouTube. <laughs> Check it later. So, we're at this point right now. We're trying to figure out if I should run all four or we should just run the two new ones since they got a bigger arc in the leaf pack because uh, right now if you can see it sits pretty pretty high it's almost touching the roof yeah it's 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 almost there. It's about about to hit, so I think that's perfect height. It's almost about to hit something that's perfect height. So we'll see. We I might go. I might go with a about an eight nine inch on the rear. So the rear, I'm gonna have a rake look, but it's like kind of like a hot rod looks. So I kind of like that better. So we might go that route. As far as the clamps, do you see the clamps? We just bend them out and uh, might go and cut it off. We have a uh, dual centering pins, like I mentioned earlier, so I don't think these leaves are gonna rotate on a, like a single single centering pin. So I'll keep you guys updated. So update: we finally got all the leaves together. Um, took us a damn good while, but. Reggie and I got it, so this is how it looks. Yeah, it looks like the original BDS leaf pack. Oh shit! <laughs> look at that. All we gotta do is just spray paint this black and she look all brand new new. Alright, so another update later. Alright. Alrighty. Finally finished. Took a lot of finagling. A lot of uh, a lot of stress. So but we finally got it in the final product so this is stock stock spring aftermarket stock aftermarket stock and stock so yeah it's pretty much we got everything all aligned uh, we use the old centering pins to kind of align everything so I don't damage the new ones oh uh, we gotta tighten this down but other than that we got them aligned cinched it up put the new bolts in centering pins then uh, just to keep it aligned that we put the u-bolts on cinched everything down tight then now we gotta zap this down and uh, pretty much done so now to the other side but we're gonna eat some lunch first so we'll be back alrighty so we finally finished finally got everything up I put the rear drive shaft spacer everything all bolted up I ran it around the block a couple times. My boy Reggie torqued everything out again. Reggie, how was it? Don't dodge it, grab it. 
yeah, you guys heard that. <laughs> I'm not gonna show you guys yet. I'm gonna go wash the truck. The one is all buttoned up and I got all the center caps on and stuff. I'm gonna show you guys. Stay tuned for real. Let them, let them know, Reggie. Let them know. Oh, oh, you got a little peek. <laughs> but yeah, I'll let you guys see it when it's nice up and pretty. All right, stay tuned. What's up, everybody? So we're back on the final day. I'd like to first off and say super massive shout out to Reggie. My boy helped me a lot. Lend me his house and his driveway for pretty much the weekend and uh, kind of taking up space at his house. But Reggie, shout out to you, man. Also, big shout out, big massive shout out to Andy from BDS Suspension. Thank you so much for sponsoring the parts for my truck. Hopefully in the future, we can collab again with maybe some upgrades, maybe some dual shock hoops, maybe some coilover conversions in the future. Again, Andy. Thank you so much. Without further ado, enjoy. The beast herself. Check that out. So, just to recap, kind of go over my truck. So it is a 2015 Ram 3500 Mega Cab with the 67 Cummings ice in transmission. Let's start from the shoes. Let's start from the front. So we got. 38, 15, half, 20s, Mickey Thompson's, MTZ P3s, so you guys that doubt me that I run in 38s, there you go, big tires, big meats, these are KMC XD 20 by 12s, Panzers, like I said, these are like the old school weld stone crushers, old school look we got the newly converted 8 inch BDS 4 link long arm suspension as far as the underneath we got dual steering stabilizers and if you guys can see right there we got the new adjustable track arm from BDS I think it's super super beefy compared to the original OE track bar <laughs> back to the rear so this is a dual dual spring upgrade from BDS if you see earlier like I mentioned these are stock aftermarket stock aftermarket stock and stock also the two new centering pins the rear shocks I just kept the same rear shocks I didn't upgrade it I believe these are already for the 8 inch so I did not opt to upgrade I did take out my spare tire and the heat shield it was not needed so I took it out oh yeah one thing too if you guys notice I did not put the cap on this one because this is actually the spare tire so I have to switch this out and put the other one at home with the sensor in one thing too i did not want to go too wide these are 12 wide and i think they're perfect i did want my drivability still i didn't want to go too wide and lose my turning radius 
because I did have to cut a little down there also in the video it shows where I chopped up I still gotta chop some stuff up I still gotta chop a little bit of the pinch road right here might go with a Dremel and just cut a good section out just to just to get my somewhat turning radius back but she still goes she looks super freaking killer now wide enough man I want to end the vlog right here please like if you like the video if you like how my truck look if you like how everything's going on my truck please like the video please hit the notification bell so when I do upload a new video like this with some killer content you guys know about it comment what you guys think about my truck how do you like what do you like about it subscribe to the channel please Help me out. Let's grow this channel. Let's take one last look. Damn. She's a freaking beast. So I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the big reveal of my truck. The new lift, the new tires. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Alright. Peace. I'm out.